Hey guys, so I just wanted to pop on and do a quick little video. Um, it might actually be kind of long, but that's okay. A uh, video for basically newer people um, or people who are struggling to get uh, PRV. So uh, to start with the new newer uh, people who have just joined, um, when you first join it can be kind of overwhelming because there's a lot to think about. Um, so usually what I like to do is focus on what's the first thing uh, that's coming. So for example, uh, when you first join, your kit comes in a couple days, you should have a launch party or someone to do a home party for you right away uh, within your first 15 days because that will get you off to an amazing start and you won't be struggling to find contact. Uh, I personally like to do a launch party, which means you do the party, you have everyone over at your house, uh, you ask your sponsor to come to your party because they can help you out, answer any questions, things like that. Um, after, within the first 15 days, you can reach your shooting star. Uh, you get a cute little pin that says you've achieved, achieved your, or sorry, you get a charm that uh, is a shooting star and a little certificate saying you've achieved your shooting star. Um, as well, you have the chance to buy, uh, I think it's like a $360 kit um, for $240. So it's a great opportunity to build your stock for not much money. Um, and if you are into or going to be big into like vendor sales, uh, fairs, things like that, this kit uh, is perfect to take to those events. Um, it will also give you um, something out of basically every cattle every section of the catalog so um, it's great to build up your personal stock uh, anyways so the next um, level to hit is certified basically you have to sell about twelve hundred and fifty dollars in sales to get a thousand PRV our pay system works on PRV so basically it's one PRV for every dollar twenty sold this works out uh, actually so that basically all regions, so anywhere that sells Sensi is on an equal pay rate, so not like regardless of the exchange and things like that, we're all getting the same dollar. Um, so when you hit certified, you'll always stay there unless you start recruiting. Um, obviously, uh, recruiting is personally my favorite. Um, I like to recruit because I love having other people in this business. Um, especially because I want to help them do what I've done. So um, if you want to start recruiting, that's um, something that you can talk to your sponsor about. Uh, or exactly how you joined, that's how your recruits are going to join. They're going to go to your website, they're going to sign up, and they're going to do the same things that you've done. I won't go into recruiting um, just because this isn't really what I wanted the video to be about. Um, so basically you will stay at certified until you start recruiting. So you will go from 20% to 25% once you hit certified. Um, another great bonus is um, we do not get a discount up front. However, we get a 20 or 25% discount on the things you personally purchase. So when you're doing a show order, um, you either add yourself as a guest or you are the hostess and everything you buy at regular retail price, um, you are given a 20, per, 20 or 25% discount back on your commission. So you will notice a little bit of a difference on your commission if you're calculating your PRV versus what you bought. Um, so the next thing I'll talk about is promoting your business. The best way to promote your business, hands down, is through Facebook. People need to know that you sell Sensi. If you are not posting something at least once a week, um, people aren't going to know you're selling Sensi and chances are people won't come to you. You'll find out that your friends are buying from another rep um, and it's just because you simply don't promote your business. Um, after Facebook, there's other social media tools, um, you know, Instagram, uh, YouTube, uh, Twitter, things like that. Like you can promote on all of those. Number one rule, you do not absolutely in no way sell stock online. You cannot promote that you have stock for sale. You cannot go on any social media pages and post that, uh, say, a couple hand creams, contact me to buy some hand creams. None of that. No buying and selling online. Um, 
Next thing is um, a party order. So once you start promoting your business, you're going to get some orders and you're not sure what to do. So you're going to log into your workstation. I'm hoping that uh, by now everyone would know how to log into their workstation. But basically, uh, you just go. You can, the easiest way is to go to your website. So whatever it is, for example, mine's robingibson.sensi.ca. Scroll all the way to the bottom, and you'll see a workstation login uh, link. Just click that; it'll take you right to workstation. You enter your ID and password, and you'll come up to workstation home screen. There's an order tab. That's where you're going to submit all your orders, whether it's a party order, an individual order, uh, or a Sensi business, a uh, Sensi family store order, which is all business supplies. So um, the Sensi order, you are going to go into it, fill out all your information. You're going to fill out the hostess's information, and again, the hostess information. It could be yourself, which is fine, and then you're going to choose a shipping address. I personally like to ship every single order to myself because then I can label it, uh, I can check everything, I can make sure uh, everything's intact, nothing's broken, that sort of thing. And I've never ever had a problem, so, um, and if you do have a problem, like Sensi will take care of it right away. Uh, so I, ch I send it to myself on that first screen. Second screen you're going to go to is all the order for, order area. So you're going to see a legend on the uh, left hand side which tells you how much your hostess credits are at, your PRV, things like that. Watch your PRV, watch your hostess credits, watch your free shipping. At $200 in Canada, um, we get free shipping. So you um, want to make sure you're getting a $200 mark because you don't want to pay shipping on all the orders. Um, but also at $200 you get your hostess credits. So it works out really well to get a $200 order and it doesn't really take much to get a $200 order. Um, the next thing is you can add a guest always. If anyone is asking you to order, never put it under your own name. Always have it under their name. For whatever reasons, you do not want them to have any warranty problems and then Sensi not be able to find their uh, name in the database. So always try to fill out all of their information, their name, their address, their email address, their phone number, everything. Uh, this also works great for follow-ups and mail-outs. So normally what I do every couple months uh, is mail um, like a postcard or something, a catalog or something to customers to know, hey, I'm still thinking about you, let me know if you need anything. Um, so you're going to add them as a guest or if you are not the hostess, you can add yourself as a guest too. So once you hit your $200 hostess credits pop up, you're going to see this perpetual reward and uh, it's listed under the half price items. This is a bonus half price item basically given uh, to the hostess and if someone books a party at her party if she goes to their party she gets that half price item. Uh, personally I like to use it for uh, giving my hostess an extra free plug-in or free something. Uh, so it works out really well. Uh, it's a good um, item to use to use to book parties too. So if you um, you know aren't going to give your hostess anything, which you don't have to, it is nice to sometimes I'll give them a little hand cream uh, or something like that. Like you do not always have to give them something, but obviously they've just hosted a show for you and you want them to uh, feel special and you want to want to thank them. Uh, so I like to do a free plug-in. Uh, to my hostess or like a little gift basket if I don't use my perpetual reward but basically the perpetual reward you can give to any guest on the list so it can be yourself the hostess the hostess's friend the mother anything like that okay so the next screen you'll get to after all your orders are submitted double check your orders make sure everything's correct make sure that if you could combine and save you have which they're in the catalog so you, uh, it's super easy uh, your next page will be your visa payment screen. You can enter multiple visas on this screen, so you don't have to worry about everyone paying cash to you. Um, enter their visas, hit hit add, and just keep adding until you've gotten all their visa cards, whatever. If, if there is a difference left, that can go on your credit card. Just make sure you've gotten the payment for it, and um, uh, you'll pay the difference, so it'll come off your credit card. Uh, so that's it and then you hit submit and it'll go through if there's any problems it'll decline and you'll know right away. Um, so if you have any problems with that reach out to your sponsor let them know you need some help with your workstation. That's the easiest way to explain it. 
um, the Sensi Family Store, which you will see on the order screen right under the Sensi order, is for business supplies. So basically catalogs, order forms, bags. Uh, we get bags in every order, so you really don't have to order them. Uh, I like to order the Sensi branded ones just for uh, just to have a Sensi branded bag, but uh, I use the clear bags sometimes at events, or I give them away to people who like are doing events and they need bags, that sort of thing. Uh, but there's tons of stuff, business cards. You can order basically anything you need right there. T-shirts, everything. If it's uh, in Canada, if it's over sixty dollars, you get free shipping. I'm not a hundred. I think in the states it's fifty dollars. And to be honest, I'm not sure what Australia is. I'm gonna say seventy probably, but uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure. So maybe if one of you girls can comment under here, uh, just to help uh, your Australian girls out. Um, so the Sensi Family Store, I love it. It's usually my go-to place, uh, just because then it's all approved. You don't have to worry about getting uh, promotional items approved, things like that. Um, the next thing. So uh, obviously booking parties or basket parties, some sort of party to get your sales going is key. Um, to be completely honest, if I didn't book parties from parties, I would never have kept going. Like my business has totally survived on booking parties from parties. I do one or two parties a month and they are my lifeline. I absolutely love my parties. Um, I've gotten many recruits from parties or through party contacts um, and they just work out really well. My personal uh, favorite is a home party, just because I can get uh, more personal with people. I can explain my sensory experience, things like that. And uh, people really like it. People like the one-on-one -on -one, um, interaction. And everyone needs a night out. Everyone loves to host parties and get free stuff, so it works in my advantage. Um, when I do a party, I keep it simple. I bring, maybe, I bring a plug-in, I bring a full-size warmer, maybe a deluxe warmer. Um, maybe a lampshade if I have it in stock. I bring a couple bars just so they can get the idea of a bar. Uh, I love the, I personally love the layers line, so I always make sure I have layers products with me. Um, and I usually will sell layers products because it's, it's amazing. Um, so yeah, bring whatever you feel you want to bring. You don't have to bring everything in the catalog. It's too much. Bring one little tote bag. Actually, I'll show you the tote bags that I bring. Um, and they're super easy. So these are the tote bags I bring. And they're just like little uh, tote bags, double-sided. They have little pockets on the front and the side. And then uh, they fit a couple warmers, all my stuff, that sort of thing. So I don't have to, um, I don't take a ton of stuff. And then, of course, I have my testers in a different uh, box. But it keeps it simple for me. I'm making one trip in. Um, at your parties, the best way to promote booking a party is like booking bags, booking games, that sort of thing. I'm not going to go into detail uh, about booking par about like the booking games themselves. There's tons of resources on our group pages, on Workstation, on YouTube. Uh, YouTube actually was one of the things that I would spend literally hours on watching every YouTube video I can. I would just search Sensi Games, Sensi Consultants, Sensi Ideas. And I would sit there for hours watching YouTube videos. Everyone has different ways of doing this. And if I can get the idea from someone else without having to do a lot of work, it's perfect for me. Um, so yeah, make sure you're always doing a booking game. If you need some ideas, just ask and or post on the uh, Facebook groups. You'll get, you'll get some tons of feedback. Um, the next thing, when it's all over, I think my hostess, I give her a little, um, the dollar store has like the super small little bags. I put a scent circle in there and sometimes a hand lotion, body butter, something like that. Uh, and thank her for the party. And of course she gets to pick her free plug-in or whatever I chose that month as my hosting special. Um, usually it's a free plug-in or a, a free warmer of their choice depending on the month. So when we get into an incentive month, obviously my sales are important. So I give away, uh free full-size warmers to host a party um, as long as it's over $200 party. Um, so the next thing after that, you're going to want to connect with anyone who wanted a party. Make sure you have your calendar ready. I always, always have my calendar. It's full of stuff right now, but um, I always have my calendar ready. Like It's full of stuff that I'm doing so that I can book their party right then and there. I give them a business card, I write the date right on the back of it, and I let them know I'll call them within a, 
uh, two weeks of their party. In the two-week mark, I call them and let them know, hey, it's Robin, I just wanted to let you know, wanted to follow up with your party we have booked in two weeks. Um, I let them know that a week in advance, I will drop off a basket. So basically, I give them my tote bag full of anything that I would bring and my testers. And I let them know, keep this for the next week in case anyone can't come to your bar party or um, you want to take it to work, things like that. Use it at your home. Use it however you'd like. If you can get some outside sales, it'll help with your party. So they always have a basket about a week in advance. Sometimes people won't take it, which is totally fine. Um, usually people will take it. So I'll drop it off about a week in advance. And then the night of the party, I'm only bringing my goodie bags. They have my stuff. It's all set up, ready to go for when I come in. Um, I let them set it. I ask them to set it up however they want. So it's set up how it's going to work for the hostess, not for me. Um, and, you know, the testers can be all over the table, that sort of thing. But, um, and then I'm ready to go. I just have my party bags. So I'll have so, uh, some booking bags for if they book a party, I give them a little goodie bag right away. Um, maybe some gifts. If it's a smaller party, I'll, I like to hand out some little things to everyone for coming. Uh, if it's a larger party, I'll do, say, I'll do a couple questions or some games and hand out some things that way. Uh, I personally love... Um, the higher or lower game. It's just so fun and everyone gets like so competitive and it's it's really a lot of fun. Um, and that way I avoid my catalog walkthrough because that is a catalog walkthrough. So I'm not sitting there explaining Sensi. I'm doing a fun game. At the end of it a couple people win a prize. So party closes. Uh, all your stuff comes in. Make sure you label everything and you can use the Sensi labels. Actually I'll show you those too. You can use Sensi labels or you can get labels from the dollar store. Both of them work fine. Um, I personally like the Sensi labels because then I don't really have to do much work. So these are the Sensi labels. There's like a thousand for 38 bucks. They peel off great. They go on like amazing. Um, and the best thing is they're like um, glossy. So yeah, they're glossy. So um, the oil, like the oils don't seep into the labels. I find uh, with the paper labels, and these are just from the dollar store. It has the instructions on the back. Um, there are 30 labels per, sh so it's 360 labels. And I think it's like about two bucks. Um, uh, but the oil, if it's been on the bar for a while, the oil will like leak into it. Uh, and it just doesn't look nice. Like I prefer to keep it clean. Um, if you are labeling a bar, I'll show you this as well. If you're labeling a bar, you can label it inside. Totally fine. But what I do is label it right on the front. You can't cover up like the little things here. You put it right on the barcode. Um, you can't la you can't label over the Sensi stuff. So if you label over the barcode, it's fine. So that's what I like to do. There we go. Looks nice and pretty, and then people uh, see it right away. Um, so yeah, I label everything, and then I have a little tip card, which is actually in our file section of the group. I print that off, and if I do a home party, I'll put, uh, for example, Joan, your hostess got three half price items, fifty dollars in free free stuff. Um, and a personal gift from me for hosting the show. So I like to say what they got because it kind of sparks interest for another party. So uh, I put some ribbon on the bag. I deliver everything to my hostess. So I am not doing personal deliveries. Everything goes to my hostess. I also do a little thank you card. Um, I just usually buy the Sensi cards and uh, there's like, I, I forget how many is in a pack, but uh, they usually go on sale for like eight, five to eight dollars. And uh, that's what I buy. And I'll usually, of course, I'm a Sharpie fan. So I take all my Sharpies and I do my thank you letters. And I put a little thank you note in the bags. Um, usually I offer a personal special. And um, I put my business card, um, a little flyer of the month for the next month, and uh, the tip card. So everyone has lots of information. And the hostess gets everything. Um, and then within a couple weeks, I just follow up. How is everyone liking their stuff? How's the hostess liking everything? If anyone needs anything, hopefully the bulbs are good, blah, blah, blah. Let me know if anyone needed an extra bulb. Because sometimes they go, they blow out or whatever in shipping. They get bashed up or whatever. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. 
Um, and I, I think it's just a great idea to be really personal with everyone. Um, so a really good idea is to add people on Facebook. And if they're on your Facebook, they're going to see all your stuff. And they're going to be thinking about your Sensi all the time. Um, I've gotten quite a few recruits because I keep people on Facebook. And I think it's, you know what, I love talking to my customers. So um, even if they're just there and they buy like every six months, that's totally okay. They're still there. They're still seeing your stuff, that sort of thing. Um, I post if I'm doing any events like any fairs or trade shows. I always post where I'm going to be so people can come and see me. Um, and what else? That's pretty much it. I promote Sensi like three times a day. Uh, it's just what I do. Um, and that's it. So um, the biggest way to maintain your 150 PRV, I like to say per month because if you keep going every month, uh, you're going to stay active. If you're ordering once every three months, it's going to be hard to come up with orders. Um, if you're staying active every month submitting a $200 order, you're more than likely to keep going rather than stopping every three, once, every three months ordering. Um, so the best ways if you're stuck, for anyone who's been a consultant for a little while, have an open house, have a patio party, it's beautiful outside right now. Uh, use the coconut lemongrass as a, as a promoting item because um, it helps with the bugs, it, mosquitoes don't like the smell, that sort of thing. Think of fun, unique ways to have people over and don't feel like you're um, bombarding people with your business because you know what, the fact of the matter is everyone's going to help you if they're your friend or your family they're going to help you um, and you can get con contacts through your friends and family so don't underestimate the power of parties because they are huge um, everyone knows somebody different so it doesn't matter and this goes for being a rep too it doesn't matter how many reps are in your town or on your street or how many reps you personally know you know so many more people than than they don't so um, Everyone does something. Someone's kid may be in hockey. Someone else's kid might be in baseball. Two totally separate groups of people. Um, that's pretty much it. Just always be promoting your business. Um, always be reaching out to your sponsor. And if you're a sponsor, make sure you are reaching out to your team because it's really overwhelming sometimes to just be given a kit and a catalog and be told, okay, here's your stuff. Have a good day. Um, so try to be there for your team. And uh, if you are a new recruit and you are not feeling like your sponsor, uh, is helpful, reach out to someone above them. So you all have upline directors. Uh, right now it's either uh, myself, Robin Gibson, uh, Robin Constantopoulos, Amber Sawyer, or I think she might be under uh, King. Uh, Amber Sauer or Amber King, I'm not sure what it is on your workstations, uh, or Darcy Scullin. So please reach out to them um, if you need some help. And uh, if not, uh, let me know, post on the team pages, that sort of thing. But do some research. Always know what's going on. Check YouTube for some great ideas. And you know what? If you have a great idea, post it. Share it. I post things all the time for my team um, for you guys to see. Share ideas. It's awesome having ideas being shared because we all have different ideas. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, you can comment on uh, the link or post on the team page or whatever. Okay, so good luck, guys.